incredible woman. She is an incredible mother. She loves her son Baron so much and just uh, really something special. And I have to say, she will make an unbelievable first lady. So I'd like to introduce my wife, Melania. Come. Thank you. Thank you. It is wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. We love you too. It is wonderful to be here today with you and with my husband. I'm very proud of him. He's hard worker. He's kind. He has a great heart. He's tough. He's smart. He's a great communicator. We have an amazing relationship. And it's very physical. I mean, he still pushes all my buttons. And, um, you know, people say, oh, but he's so much older than you. And you know what? I'm the one having to push him away. <laughs> he's a great negotiator. He's telling the truth. And if we can't do that, we fake it. And you are raised with so many of the same values. On me. Like the values. You work hard that you work for what you want. Like. What you want to <laughs> that your word is your that bond. That you do what you bond. say you're going to do. And you do what that you, you say. That you treat people your bonds. Yeah. That you treat people yeah. yeah. with respect. Yeah. Even if you don't they know God. And show you the values and morals in their daily life. That is a lesson. And the Lord Jesus. The many generations to you follow our children. Because we want our children, our children, children in this to nation to know that the your dream is to your achievements and is the strength to work your hard dreams for them. and your willingness to work for them. Well, we work together very well. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost as like where we have one brain that we share between us. Uh, <laughs> has been accused of plagiarizing portions of her speech from Michelle Obama's appearance at the 2008 Democratic Convention. Mrs. Trump, I, I understand that you have a statement. Yes, that is true. I wrote it. <laughs> My fellow Americans. I wake up every morning in a house that was built by slaves. Playing with their dogs on the White House lawn. And, be and because of Hillary Clinton, my daughters and all our sons and daughters now take for granted that a woman can be President of the United States.